welcome to my channel. Happy Christmas. It's Christmas Day. We have stuffs. We got presents. We got even better presents. Oh, I'm just looking at your face and you're such a grotty kid. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. What did you get? Well, no, actually, wait. Before you um, see the rest of the video, please consider subscribing, ring the bell for a notification, and be there for when we upload a video next. These videos are actually continuing into Little Christmas, the 6th of January, so we're going to be daily doing some more unboxings and just daily kind of vlogs. Okay, Sophie wants to show you what she got. What'd you get? Andy. Okay, you need to use some words, Sophie. It's a lollipop stamp. Okay, you got a lollipop stamp. And a coin. No, you didn't. <laughs> yes, I did. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. Okay, what did you get? She's got the lollipop stamp and the coin it squished into a little container. Love heart. A little love heart. I think it might just go the other way. No. Oh, kids and their toys. And? And it says, precious little lady. Precious little lady. Yeah. What else did you get? And? You got, you are my... You know, you are so loved. What else? And These are some of her favorite things. She, oh, you got a gel pen. And you got a rainbow unicorn pen. Very cool. And, and oh, she got a bug searcher. A oh, it's, a it's got a pencil. It's got a notebook for logging all the bugs. Are you bored yet? And, you, and we got a bug catcher, so you can catch the bugs in this, and there's a little magnifying lens to be able to examine them. And then there's a little book that you write all your notes down on. And I'm hoping my surprise is going to make a show for you. We'll see. Where are you? No. What else? Oh, day 25, Christmas Day. She, oh yes, that's, oops, oh my goodness, oh, I think that's supposed to be a chocolate bomb, Sophie, it's supposed to be a hot chocolate, a hot chocolate, yes, you put that in hot milk, <gasps> and more chocolates, probably her least favourite of all of the gifts, but she got a lollipop, <laughs> do you want me to open it? Would you I like me to open it, it for myself. you? Okay. And we'll try and get this chocolate bomb. It melted in the sun because Sophie has had it in the sun. And now it's solidified and the tin foil has got folded in. So we'll have to very carefully unpick the, um, the chocolate bomb. All right. <laughs> On to Christmas Day with the Black Needle Society. This is huge mongus, as we can say. Um, oh, that was fun. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay, there's the bag. Wow. Stop, please. Oh my goodness. This is a celebrate all year with a stitch along. Okay, so there's a QR code or there's a web address. You can enter in all the bits, 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 because they're quite long. Patterns are delivered digitally. Don't, please don't. And we'll include a PDF file and a pattern keeper friendly file. The first file you will receive will be the breakdown of the stitch along instructions and dates, finishing instructions and complete threads list and fabric that you need to use during the year. In this box, you receive fabric for your January, February and March pieces. You'll also receive thread for the January piece pictured above, which is a cup of tea. Um, in January, we're celebrating National Hot Tea Month. Each month's design will feature a month-long celebration, and we choose some fun, unexpected holidays. We hope you'll join us. How cool! That's like 
Okay, so there's the cards that you will base your shape around. Holy cow, there is a finishing kit like nothing else I've ever seen to make it all kind of fancy schmancy. And no, please don't open that. This is the wooden frame that it goes into and you pop your each moment. This is the glass in here as well. Be careful. So you pop in and out your different pictures and it will grow as the year goes on. So the materials are Chantel 141 Roundup Display, which is this, and you've got to piece it together. Uh, you get 12 laser cut mounting boards, which are these. You get shear weight fusible inf uh, interfacing for 12 stitch pieces, so that's the fluffy stuff. You get black magnet square for the center of Roundup Display. So I think that is this bit here and it goes in the middle um, you get two seven and a half inch strips of magnet tape each strip to be cut into one and a quarter squares so that's the magnet tape here so you put each piece will magnetize into it there's four cuts of pom-poms and four cuts of rickrack and four cuts of chenille for each appropriate month um, and then QR code with lazy dot creates complete step by step finishing instructions. We have no excuses of not finishing because you know how we do projects and we just never get around to finishing. We've got step by step instructions, trim application instructions and lots of finishing pictures. Tips will be provided by the Black Needle Society. Oh, my goodness. This is so cool. So lazy dot creates is Lois Missouri Bear. M M sorry, Lois. Morisky Bear um, is Lady Dot Creates, and she does amazing finishing kits. So there's that, there's that, there's that, and we got the floss yesterday, which was like all the colors, all the colors for this, and the fabric for January, February, and March. Okay. Wow. That is fun. That is definitely fun. So this is going to be a year round sale with the group and it's just going to be fantastic. That that's really cool how it just pulls Christmas into the new year, into a new project, into a, a <coughs> what do they call them? A perpetual calendar kind of thing. Okay. Right, Christmas Day from Silks For You. It is, I think it's a full hank. It's pretty big. It's chenille. Look, it's purple. I love purple. It's pink inside. I Ooh. love pink too. This is what is called a full hank. Now, what I have done with my full hanks before is I have got some of these waste threads that they put on while they die so it doesn't mix up. I have looped it onto whatever I've looped it on. I've tied it in a neck around here and then I've plaited the rest and cut it down the bottom. So that is one way that you can do it and then you just pull a single floss out and that's a great length because that's a double. So you pull out two of those and you've got a fantastic length to work with. So there is your full hank from Silks for You. Oops caught on a ring so if you're ever wondering um what kind of weight i think it's about 100 grams of silk it is divine to work with and it's a gorgeous bright pink and it comes in this purple organza bag for me i don't know if it's going to be purple for everyone but hey it's cool okay now the last thing i've got is my random act of kindness stitching bag you can open it um, and I'm opening day 12 um, and we're going to count down to one and my little surprise is not making an entrance okay what is this Ooh. oh it's a little charm kit so there's a tinkly little bell which is not making much noise in the plastic 
and there's some candy cane twine and there's some silver um, embroidery so this may be used for something in the box so we'll see how we go with that one that is my random act of kindness um this morning woke bright and early sophie came into my room saying santa hadn't been and i said are you sure go check on your chair she went and checked and she still came back and she said nope there's nothing there and i said we don't have any stocking sophie what have we got lots of we've got tons and tons of pouches santa put her presents into a pouch like a <laughs> padmelon <laughs> And, and she had a purple pouch full of her little Santa goodies, these kind of things that she got. So, oop, there it goes. Um, so we got that and then we were sitting up and she went through her other gifts that she was given by some amazing people. And we, I went on to um, our wildlife rescue, Yogi Bob's. And there was a panamelon that needed to be picked up from a nearby suburb. And I said, OK, we'll go and get dressed. And if it's still there, then we'll go. Well, it turned out that somebody else grabbed it. Um, but he ended up taking it and bringing it to me. And in part and parcel for all of my day, we were going to be getting a Joey Patty for us to keep. And she got delivered finally with the ringtail possum that was gone AWOL with a member of the public who called him Mops and the Mop had been at work yesterday and wasn't contactable and then um, the poor rescuer who was trying to coordinate with them um, to collect it had had some drinks last night so couldn't get it last night so she got it this morning. So I've got this little ringtail possum who has found that he likes being buried in my hair. <laughs> So let me see if I can get him to come. Um, he, he really is buried in my hair. Oh my goodness. Oh. And they hide their heads. They do. Um, I'm actually babysitting this until his permanent care can be found. Look. Look, there he is. I'm going to leave him in my hair because, you know, he seems to And like he it. likes it. <laughs> it's probably what they do with mum. They just cling on. They've got sharp little front claws. They've got sharp black back claws and an opposable thumb. And then they've got this gorgeous tail. Beautiful, beautiful tail. Um, he's quite happy in my ponytail then. <laughs> and I'll unravel him later when, <laughs> when he's collected. But yeah, I got a ringtail balsam for Christmas. We didn't get a wombat. We did go looking for the wombat yesterday, but we didn't get a wombat. But oh my goodness, we got a ringtail possum and he is just beautiful um so i don't care that these are passed on to carers who have a Happy lot more experience Christmas. um it's just having the privilege of having a ringtail possum make a nest in your hair is not exactly normal all the rest of them are outside and the two new ones are actually in the bedroom just resting so i'm going to keep hydrating them these guys are all going to get another round of hydration. Um, and the others are outside. Yeah, but it is the cutest thing ever. It's such a privilege to share this job. This is just, it's a, it's, a, it's a pleasure to do. To share this with some amazing people. The person who's actually look, going to look after this ringtail has lots and lots of ringtails. She's got, I think, I could be wrong, but she's close to a dozen ringtails. That she's currently feeding. She's not getting much sleep, poor thing. And she works at the wildlife shelter, shelter, zoo kind of place as well. Um, she's just phenomenal. Um, so she's going to be collecting it when she's finished having some family time. And she will look after him. So, yeah. We're going to then crack on with our dinner. Um, I have managed to speak with some of my family back in Ireland um, as they were going into their Christmas Eve. That was nice. And um, yeah, they're doing Christmas in staggered starts, meals and getting together and all that kind of thing. Um, so that's good. Um, she's trying to cut into the lollipop. Okay, I better go rescue her. 
All right, I will let you guys go. Happy Christmas. And remember, if you are alone or if you have some time to give, the uh, premieres are rolling through at the moment. So please don't be alone and don't feel like you can't kind of even just go and sit and read. You don't even have to say that you're there. Um, but don't be alone. Um, go and have some fun. And um, if you've got time with family, enjoy it. If you've got time with family and you hate it, do something that you enjoy, um, even if it's just for a few minutes. Um, closing the door and breathing. Um, please have a very safe Christmas. Um, and um, yeah, we'll see you tomorrow on the video. Bye for now. May the road rise up to meet you. May the wind be always at your back. May the sun shine warm upon your face and the rain fall soft upon your fields. And until we meet again, may God hold you in the palm of his hand.